School safety measures in the Bryan School District might see extra funding in the near future. The Texas Education Agency opened up a grant for districts that are struggling over the cost of new school safety requirements. Anna Maynard's been speaking with school officials about the possible impacts of having that extra money. Anna? School districts across the state express frustration about the Texas legislators' failure to pass additional funding for their increased school safety requirements. That conversation continued at the Bryan ISD Board of Trustees meeting where they discussed their own application. The Safety and Facilities Enhancement Grant is for school districts facing financial stress from the state safety requirements. The application was open for a little over a month and the Texas Education Agency had to extend its deadline so more districts have time to apply. Bryan ISD is one of those districts. Officials say it'll help them finish several safety projects. Any additional funding is always a good thing, um, particularly in a deficit year budget. Um, when we have unfunded or underfunded mandates, clearly this kind of grant would be used to help with those. Later in the show, we'll hear what Brian ISD thinks about the new laws put in place and their frustrations with lack of funding. Live in Brian, Anna Maynard, News 3. Anna, thank you. A wanted fugitive out of Leon County is now back in custody. Jonathan Bricker was wanted for stealing a